Hi, so what can the three problems that men as sellers you may face today? One, if I sell high, I buy high. If I sell already, then what can I buy? I've bought at 1,005 PSF. I sell at 1,008 PSF. Then now I buy at 2,001 PSF. Logical, man? So my question is, is keeping your resale property really that good? Will it cause even more risk for you? Well, let us look at this resale life cycle. The behavior of the market is when you buy at 600 PSF. When the development reaches its TOP, you decided to rent, hold and rent it for your rental income. However, due to unforeseen and unavoidable circumstances in the market, this will cause your property to remain stagnant or even profit erosion. So having said so, why are owners then still not selling? Well, the reasons could be, number one, I may want to keep for rental yield. Number two, we are worried of high commitment and uncomfortability. Number three, we want to save before we buy the next one. Number four, if we sell now, we cannot buy back the same price. So if the above, any of the above questions are always on your mind, then you may want to check whether the existing property you are holding now has already reached its peak or has an indicator of flatting out. Well, if it does, then our swapping concept will definitely help you.